So I uh, read the comments from time to time, as one does when they're trying to work with the community to build something special. And uh, I see one from uh, FIFA Baby Boy. Yeah, little tiny baby boy. He's coming at me hard. Oh, you're a specialist in failure. <laughs> Shut up, FIFA Baby Boy. Don't even spell boy right. It's B-O-Y. So that one didn't really phase me all that much, you know? I see you haters. But then I go down further and uh, I see one from Charles Flowers or Carlos Flores or whatever. He says, uh, sell Inyo, buy Pep Guardiola. Those are fighting words, Charles Flowers. You understand me? Those are fighting words. So I'm like, you know what? I gotta take my game to the next level. I gotta train. I have to practice. I am going to do the Gamer Olympics. So now you got to see what I was working on. I showed you behind the scenes and I am ready to go. Except for the fact that we have some players that we have to make some decisions on. And you guys are helping me in the comments and I really appreciate that. Besides uh, FIFA baby boy. <laughs> FIFA baby boy. I see you FIFA baby boy. We're not friends right now. And we might not be friends forever. I went to the transfer hub. I'm speaking in the past tense. We are going to the transfer hub. Our scouts or whatever, Irving Lozano. I think uh, I can't pay for him because we don't even we have that type of money, but I'm not gonna fight too hard. I'm gonna approach to loan. The club isn't interested in loaning this player out. You can try approaching him. You know what? F you PSV Eindhoven. Kevin Gamero. Think he'll come on alone? Also, I threw Vicoco Pickles on the list off a suggestion by Stipe32 HD. Thank you for that, Stipe. He is a staple in any successful season in career mode for manager Inya. <sighs> Never mind. Also, I should mention Stephen Kosh. He's like, you gotta go loan Hudson Adoy. So I'm gonna try that right now. He also said, go get Ben Chilwell. And I have him on the list. And then he said, bring back Dwight Gale. And I like that a lot. Anyway, let's get to this conversation. Your mole is looking superb. We believe that a one year loan would be the perfect time for Hudson Adoy to have an impact. Sure, we're happy to let Hudson. Great. Oh, look at that smile. He's so happy right now. Look at that. I don't think I've ever seen. Well, now he's not smiling. Uh, wage split? I feel like 50 50 is fine. All right. I will enjoy the rest of my day. All right, so Hudson Adoy is on the team. That's what's up. Uh, we're gonna recall him from loan. Happy to pay that. And then while we're thinking about that, I really don't care for Iozzi Perez. I don't, Mr. Slick. So I am gonna add him to the transfer list and see if we can get any snips for him. Also to this list, I added don't butt dial me. Okay, he had to be in there, given uh, the suggestions of Vapor, Terra, and Esmond Yao. So thank you guys for that. And they also said, gotta lose. Uh, Jose Luce or Jose Win, right? And I'm like, cool, I'm totally down with that. So these are the three guys that I'm trying to ship out of here so we can get some more dough and get some players that I love, like the Coco Pickles and Kevin Gamero. I mean, whatever, some other players that can help us like Kevin Gamero and Vicoco Pickles. Also though, I do want to give a shout out to Commander Nipples, not only for a fantastic username. That is awesome. I love it. And I want to be part of the Nipples family. Can I be Captain Nipples? Captain, are you in charge? Are you, are you the highest ranked Nipples? And where do I fall in the rankings? I need to know that. But he also said, don't go for younger players like Hudson Adoy. Well, it's too late. I already got him because I am a one year manager. I'm a mercenary, I come in, I win trophies, and then I leave. So he wants me to get players ages 24 to 29. You can read his whole dissertation right here. It's like 17 lines, you can go through it. But yeah, I think that's a good suggestion overall is to think in those terms. So I appreciate that, Commander Nipples. 
Job well done. Oh no, I see it. It's red. It has a number in it and it's the goddamn emails. Yeah, Dwight Gale coming back. <clears throat> Welcome back to the squad, Dwight Gale. Let's advance. We're gonna advance everybody. We're advancing. We're advancing. What is taking so long? Oh, well, I have to press advance. Transfer offer for Clark to Monaco. Esben Yao said we should sell Clark. So we're gonna negotiate. See if we can get a little bit more for him. We're gonna get it up to 7.5. Sucka. Eventually gonna go for that. Let's go eight. Ah, oh, I could have got more. Sanaba. <sighs> Deuces, Clark. All right, can we can we play? No, I don't want to play actually. We're gonna sim this one. <laughs> but before we sim, I want to do a formation change. And this formation change is from Lesos Pesos, who said. We should try to do the 4-1, 2-1-2, narrow. And he doesn't know why it works, but it just works in FIFA 19. I'll sit with this through the simulation and see how it goes. And we wanted penalties, because that's how we roll. Way to go, fellas. Ruben Loftus-Cheek, loan. Yes, they're in. Hi, hello, yes, it's me again. But this time I'm wearing a coat and a different tie. We'll go 50-50. All right, Ruben Loftus-Cheek is on the team. Transfer on for, for Diami. Only three point, he's gotta be worth more than that. All right, we have some decisions to make. But we're gonna simulate this final. I wanna get into the season, the real season, the Premier League. So we're gonna sim. Stupid simulation, I should've played the final. Transfer offer for Perez. Let's go to the transfer hub. Oh hey, it's me, yeah. We're gonna propose something new. We're gonna go, uh, we're gonna edit. I'm gonna go 12. You take it, you take it, you take it. Oh, he did it, God, we could've gone more. Shoosh. Oh, peace out, Mr. Slick. We're gonna bring somebody else in, and it might have to be Kevin Gamero. You guys have to give me one. I'm trying to do all these things for you. You gotta give me one player that I want, okay? This is how it works. Compromise, togetherness. It's a with thing, not against. Cool, good talk. I really look forward to seeing where Mike K edits this because there's a lot of talking and a lot of behind the scenes action, not a lot of game plan. Oh, the salmon broke his toe. Uh, I want Gamero so bad. I'm not paying that. We need to find a striker stat. Somebody that's got some experience. So we got about 45 million to spend. Who's out there that's good? That will hit the back of the net on a regular basis. Let's go to breaking news. That's not Pochettino's bottom half of his face. All right, enough of the chit chat. Let's get after this. It's go time. Oh, the hype's real on this one. The opening game of the Premier League. It's happening. Look at these guys, all right. Good looking crew. Oh, Worms and goal, we're definitely gonna win. All right, fellas, let's go. Good, good. Oh, you're in. Oh, come on, butt cheek. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, let's just clear it. Just clear it. You know what? It's okay to hoof it every once in a while. Muto, you have one job. We pay you money to do one thing. That's hold the ball up under pressure. And now it's gonna lead to a goal. And now it's gonna, that's offsides. What a save by duck step though. That's a signal of intent. Nothing easy, Harry Kane. Oh, that second post is, what a screamer. Matt Ritchie, what are you doing? Is it that hard to, dude, head the ball. It's right there in front of you, head it. Oh, that's a, oh, Ruben. No. Why did, why did, oh no. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Deli Ali. Oh, the split is on. One more. He's on. Oh, what a save by Michel Vorm. First half analysis. Pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. So, you know what's really interesting is when I put the team in a 4-1-2-1-2 narrow, right? I think that's what we all saw, but they're in the 4-4-1-1 attack. What is happening? I mean, I'm pretty happy, honestly, all things considered with how it's looking, but still, we switched it, we saved it, you saw it, or maybe you didn't because we passed over that in the edit, but I promise you that happens. So I'm gonna stick with this because we've already committed 45 minutes to it and I was pretty pleased, not necessarily 
on the attacking side, but overall, I just felt like the team shape was pretty good. So I'm gonna stick with it for now. You saw, we made the change, you saw it. This is a joke, this is crazy. Why is it didn't stick? No, you don't try to play it out of that. Oh, this is trouble. Step to him, that's a goal. God damn it! I'm gonna go run to my coach and give him a big fat hug. I hate you, Harry Kane. Better. Better. Ruben lost his cheek. God, that's two. Dude. Oh, that must be nice to bring on Christian Eriksen. This is just a goddamn mess. This is where it should have been in the beginning. Why is Sorensen in my... Why is he... I'm only making one sub here, fellas. Making one sub. He's on. He's on. Go on. Go on. I don't even get a shot off? What in the app? Why would he get caught there? I had... Go on! Ruben lost his cheek! You fucking eat! Oh, yes! God damn! We deserve that! We deserve that! Still pissed though that I got caught on a breakaway when, I, yes, I should have got the ball off my feet, but still, get, let's go! Yes! Good composure here. I was gonna maybe give it to him, but what a finish! What a finish! Finally! Suck it, Mauricio Pochettino! No, get in. No! No! Yes, dubstep. Oh, get in! No! 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 No, thank the... I would have been upset for a number of reasons, but I felt like I had defended well enough up to that point. He needs to bury that. He's one of the top strikers in the world. Is that it? Game, set, match? 1-1 against Spurs at home? I'll take it. They probably maybe should have possibly beaten us, but it's fine. I'll take the points. Newcastle, baby, for life. Ho way the lads.